what's going on guys? Welcome to The Daily Dropout. I'm Joseph and tonight we're asking girls, does height matter? We want to know, does height matter? You mean like dick size or like height size? I mean, I like the guy to be taller than me, like, but that's not much for me. <laughs> it's a dominance thing, so if they're shorter than you, you automatically feel like you have more dominance than them, which is kind of uncomfortable. But if you ha if they're taller than you, like you feel like they should treat you better. I don't know. It's a it's a weird social standard. Maybe they can protect you more and more security there Something for you. Like that, yeah. Honestly, to most of the women population, height does matter. But I'm five one, so height does not matter to me. And I would like to tell you that. So I fucking love all you short guys. I love all you tall guys. I just want you to know that. I love everyone. Does height matter? Absolutely. It definitely does. Because if you're like shorter than me, no, absolutely not. Not gonna if fly. You're not, no, you're not bad. I'm five nine, <laughs> so I need someone that's six foot and above because us bitches are tall. Right, back to me. I'm five five, and like I appreciate a man that's six foot and like over me. One hundred percent, bitch. What's your opinion? Nakota? Uh, height definitely matters for sure. I mean, like. I'm not gonna like pass up somebody who's good for me, but like height obviously is like a key thing. I don't know, like I want them to be like taller than me, you know? So what if you're a tall girl? Tall girls need tall guys to love them too. Yes, they do. They do. Everyone deserves love. I love wearing heels around guys that are shorter than me. I like, I mean, I don't care. So, do you have like an ideal height in mind or a range of heights that you would prefer? Over 5'10". Okay, so like I'm 5'3", so like as long as you're 5'4 or above, you know, you're solid. 6'4". <laughs> 6'4", Six four. Six four. boom, that's the number. <laughs> yes. So I'm 5'3". Okay. Probably 5'5 five, five and above. 5'5 five, five and above. Yeah. So you, got a ni you have a very favorable range for us guys. Do you have an ideal height or range of heights in your head that would be, that you would prefer? Nothing under 5'10". Nothing under 5'10". Yeah. But if they're 5'10", they might have a chance. Exactly. 6'2", minimum. 6'2", minimum. Mm -hmm. So, right off the bat, I, I don't make the cut for shoving. It's okay. I appreciate the honesty. I'm on Tinder. Not currently, but when I was. If you're below six foot, swipe left or whatever. See, no. You're saying you'd swipe left on me? Swipe, you're taller than me. I'm taller than you, but I'm not six Wait, foot. As long as you're just like a little bit taller than me, I'm good. Do I pass the test? Yes, you do. Thank goodness. Six foot or six one, no other heights are available to me. So six foot, six foot one, six foot two, it's a six no go. Two is kind of too tall. 5'11 is definitely too short. Is there a correlation by how tall or short someone is and the size of their penis? No. None at all. Really? Yes. Really? No, I definitely agree. I agree too. As well. It's unanimous. Honestly, genetics. Honestly. Genetics. Sometimes it's very shocking. You're like, oh fuck. And then you're like, god damn. And then it's like, okay, his dick is big. You can be surprised, honestly. I don't think height matters because I've seen really, really tall guys with small penises. So, I mean, and vice versa. So, no. So, like, I fucked this short guy with a big penis, but I've also fucked a, a tall ass guy with a short penis. So, you gotta mix the middle of that, and then it's like a good length, you know? <laughs> right, so you, you've had you've had a couple outliers, you're just looking for the one right in the middle. For sure, I, for sure, for sure. You know, there's always outliers, you gotta pick the good one, you know? How do you know how to pick the good ones? Is it a gut thing? You just keep checking, bro, I don't know. <laughs> It's not about the size, it's about how you use it. Oh, okay. I have a theory. Let's hear this. <laughs> Breaking right here, Megan's theory. <laughs> that your penis size depends on how high pitched your voice is. On how high pitched your voice is? Yes. The foot size? Girls, you know what I'm talking about, okay? When the foot size big, you know what else is big. All right, enough said. Mic drop. You would be surprised at the actual men that are raised that have a normal, decent-sized penis, and 
and I I honestly think that any penis is great. How does it go? A guy that's like five five could be thick enough for a guy that's like five ten or five like nine. Think about it. If you have a higher pitched voice, your penis is smaller. If you have a lower pitched voice, your penis is bigger. That's just how biologically it works. <laughs> so if you're a flute, you got a small penis. If you're a baritone or a bass, you're, you're all. That's what I believe in. <laughs> that's a that's a good theory. So what you're saying is, instead of looking up and admiring how tall the guy is, check out what shoes he has on, how big the shoes are. That's Every how you girl knows this. It's one on one. If he has a big shoe size, he has a she's big saying no. It does not matter. It does not matter. When does right. size ever matter? This would be another segment where we would talk about this. And we will definitely have you guys back when that yes. segment comes around. Thank you so much, Joseph, for having us. My name is Faith. We love you. And this we, is. Gina. And I love you guys. Thank you so much. Is it? Is it okay if we use this for our video? Yes, and of course. You yes, guys are the best. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to follow us on Instagram.